it's me Imad. So today in this video tutorial we will learn about how to use the serial monitor or serial visualizer a module within the SimulID simulator. We are using the serial monitor with that of Arduino Uno. So now first of all we have to write Arduino or we, we can just write Uno in the component section and we got our Arduino Uno microcontroller. We can, we can click on it and drag it out here. Now you can see that this is our Arduino Uno microcontroller. Now we can click on it, we can go and we can click on horizontal flip. Okay now this is our Arduino microcontroller and now we will go and we will search for our serial monitor. So we can write here serial and we got our serial terminal here. So we can click on it and we can drag it out like this. Now we can see that there are two pins that is TX the transmitter one and RX is the receiving one. And this is open button. It is used for the visualization of the serial data incoming or outgoing. So now we need to connect the TX pin with that of RX and RX pin with that of TX of the Arduino Uno like this. So this is our basic setup, hardware setup. So now we will go to our Arduino IDE. So you must know that how to install the Arduino IDE. So here we will go and we will write new sketch here. And we got our new window. Here you can see that there are two main functions that is wired setup and wired loop. In wired setup we can initialize and declare certain uh, functions and certain we can say that initializations. Means that here we will declare serial dot begin 9600. So now what is this? Serial dot serial is, a, a, is our main class and dot begin is the function. And with the help of this object, we can fetch this main class. Okay. So, and uh, in the parameter brackets, we have written this 9600. It is actually the baud rate, a baud rate of the serial communication. So, we are not going into the complexity that how it used to work. We can just, we, we just have declared this function here. Now, in while loop, we can write anything like a serial dot print ln like a, we can write Nelson Darwin okay and we can write delay of 1000 now serial.println function will actually just print this text on the serial monitor and delay of 1000 means that one second delay because 1000 is the microseconds uh, sorry milliseconds so we can run it out And now our compilation has done. Now we can see the hex file link here. So this is our hex file link. We can copy it out. So this. Press Ctrl C. Go to the Simul ID. We can right click on Arduino Uno. We can go to at Mega328. We can go to Properties. We can paste the link here. And press enter and you can see firmware successfully loaded and uh, now we can run it out now we can click on open now you can see that our data has been printed on the serial monitor so hopefully you got the concept that how you can use the serial monitor or serial terminal within the SimulID simulator so thanks for visiting our channel and don't forget to subscribe